College football still hangs in the balance because of COVID-19, but in the last few days, Baylor basketball has taken several major steps toward winning a title. 25 News reporter Jack Allen has more. From the moment COVID-19 ended his sophomore season early, Baylor guard Jared Butler has been left with a very difficult decision. Come back for another year at Baylor and risk potentially injuring himself or plunging into an uncertain NBA draft future during especially uncertain times. He said it's one of the most difficult decisions he's ever had to make. Oh, oh. Jared Butler is used to lighting up the Ferrell Center scoreboard, but for months his future was up in the air as fans across the country waited on a decision. So I trained as if I was going to play in the NBA. Butler has spent the last four months fine tuning his game and taking calls from NBA teams instead of working at the Ferrell Center. Because of COVID-19, those calls all took place over Zoom. Asking me a question and then just be like, okay. And uh, you just got to be confident enough to uh, answer those questions and, and sell yourself. Butler declared for the draft in April, but signed with an NCAA certified agent, meaning he could still come back to Baylor. But while he could have been a first round pick this year, he's betting on himself. And I think for me, I have a chance to be a first round lottery pick type player. And um, with, with, with the guys we got coming back and how successful our team could be, I think. Um, I, I don't want to miss out on the opportunity. Monday morning, just before the deadline, Butler announced he'll be back to campus for another season. I want to win a national title for Baylor. I want to win a big coach championship for Baylor. And uh, just one of those things I really want to do for sure. He's joined by Macy Oteague, who announced his plans to return to school in a video on Twitter in July. I'll be back at Baylor the next season to finish off what we started. The pair's decision means Baylor will only lose Freddie Gillespie and Devontae Bandu from last year's lineup. Baylor is expected to enter the 2020 season ranked number one in the nation. A glimmer of hope for whenever the Bears return to the court again. In Waco, Jack Allen, 25 News.